Welcome. Scott here. Today I am bringing another run to clear stage 85 of the Hall of Illusions. This time, I will be using Black Asta as the party main damage dealer. The party team comp consists of Gipso, William, Sally, and Black Asta. The boss can cause certain buffs to fail as it prevents you from raising speed. Heath will start off with a countdown meter of 6. Once the meter reaches 0, he will unleash his special to nuke your party. The key strategy in using this team comp is tanking the attack with William's forward 5 buff from his special along with Asta's total defense buff from his skill too. Have Black Asta survive that attack and have him run amok with his anti-magic. The boss has 2 million HP. Upon clearing it for the first time, you will get a 4 will shards, 3 fragment of wills, 2 crystal of wills and 1200 black crystals. You will also get a LR accessory summon chest. Like my previous runs, party setup is important here. You can use any combination of the mages to do this run. The run that I am using is William, Gifso, Sally, and Asta. The second combination is William, Gifso, Finral, and Asta. The third combination is William, Season 3 Gauche, Sally and Asta. William has a 4 speed set gear with 2 defense piece set. You need to max out his support talent will so that you can engrave a speed stone. He will be fastest unit in Black Clover Mobile if he has maxed enhancements. For Sally and Gifso, I recommend you to upgrade their skill too since upgrading them can raises the chance of activation or the potencies of the buffs received. When I am doing this run, I have the both skills level at level 2. Before I continue with the fight key overview, let me proceed to talk a bit about Black Asta's gear and setup. Like my Ryu run, the real pain in doing this run is actually getting prepared to do the run. First of all, you need to ramp up Asta's battle power. For gear sets, I give him the following. One small attack piece and defense piece from the Great Merchant's collection set. One small attack piece and defense piece from Secret of Deep Sea set. One small attack piece and defense piece from Ominous Gear set. The last piece can be any LR defense piece. All gears need to be at LR plus 12 and enchant them with focus on the following substats, critical rate, critical damage, and critical resistance. You will need higher critical rate than the one I am using if you are using Finral instead of Sally for your critical rate buff support. All his skills are maxed level 5. For his attack talent will, I have selected battle frenzy and increased attack. For his defense talent will, I have selected increased defense and endurance. For his support talent will, I have selected resolution and increased accuracy and penetration. For craved stones, I have used the one that we have gotten for the rewards from recent spire of honor, critical damage, defense, and critical resistance for Asta. For the unit enhancement, he is at maxed at level 5. The skill page is at level 3 or skill page with 2 level enhancements. To raise his defense to beyond 20,000, you need to equip UR grade accessories. To get UR or LR grade accessory you can get them from either rare drops at daily limited challenge, design accessory with Vanessa or exchange for summon box at the guild shop for 400 guild coins. Guild coins can only be obtained by participating in guild events. Ideally, you will want defense stats primary accessories for Asta. For skill enhancement materials, you can buy them monthly at regional world shop. You can also get them weekly from guild shop with guild medals and monthly from guild shop with guild coins. Lastly, you can also buy them with premium black crystal at the premium black crystal shop. Defense stats enchantment. Generally, the key objective is raise Asta defense above 20,000 so he can survive the nuke attack. The requirements might be lower as this is based on my estimation. Here is a quick overview on the fight process. At the start of the fight, the boss will initiate a countdown meter of 6. You need to get everything ready before the countdown meter reaches 0. Buffs activation. Gifso and Sally gives powerful buffs but by default, the skills don't have 100% activation. So keep an eye on the buffs before you proceed to the next step. 
make sure you see all the buffs procs before you continue. This is essential for Black Asta to do his nuke. Activate your total defense and fortify buff just before the countdown meter reaches zero. Asta should survive it while everyone else will die. As his HP drop below 40%, Asta will activate his anti-magic stance and you will be able to run amok on the boss. As my Asta don't have high critical rate substats, I have to pray for critical damage. Use his special. Upon using skill 1 will replenish his special use again. Hopefully you can kill the boss before the countdown meter reaches zero. You can try to boost your party damage with gear food like using turquoise diadon salad. But do remember resetting the run will consume the food as well. It took me 4 tries before I finally nail it on my 4th attempt. Now with the briefing done, let us proceed with the run. Game, kiddo! 